see how the overtime uh, calculated inside the payslip so today we will see uh, the custom way how we can do this so in the time of module we added the option to pay uh, request for the overtime okay so uh, this here is the uh, overtime request and employee can request on uh, overtime request and they can select the start date estimated hours they can select the project whatever they have worked uh, and uh, the work package or task uh, on that uh, whatever they worked uh, they can add the reason for this one and uh, it automatically populated the approval first approval and the second approval the first approval is basically the project manager so uh, whatever project we have chosen here the uh, project manager is automatically set as the first approver and the second approver is employee uh, line manager or the manager of the employee okay it also calculate that is uh, so the date you selected based on that is it on a public holiday or it is in the weekend so not in the weekend but it is generic day or uh, or is it on a public hotel holiday so it is automatically calculated why we need to calculate this one because in the south africa if someone is working on public holiday like overtime then they have to pay two times and uh, if uh, they worked uh, on the weekend then they have to pay 1.5 uh, so so that's why we just considered uh, this in here also so here you can see i already requested uh, like a two is already done so one is on a public holiday and another one is on a pub, uh, weekend okay so uh, after doing this uh, just go to the payslip and uh, here in the payslip uh, we have a exactly the information of if it is over time 2.0 then how many uh, how many hours we worked uh, and based on the rate we define on the contract it just calculated the uh, total amount over here okay so uh, so that, that 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 can be uh done by the cat over time so when uh, we create the payslip and we click on the cat over time it will automatically add in the other input so here you can see 2.0 public holiday and the five hours they worked and the uh, overtime 1.5 and they worked the three hours okay now the another thing what we need to configure on the contract you can just go to the contract in the salary information we have to define the rate of the overtime 1.5 and the overtime 2.0 so it is based on the contract itself okay and uh, based on that we will just calculate in the salary computation Thanks for watching.